Hey everybody, it's Crappy the Craps Man Regression Obsession. Hope everybody's doing good. I'm doing great. I had to hang out over here all day before I go back to the casino. Check out this place, man. You guys, if you get a comp trip here, man, I would recommend if it's good weather. I don't expect much of a beach. In the morning, I was thinking about doing a video of a walkthrough for other people, not just you guys, but other people that want to come here. Um, but anyway, it's not really a beach. It's just that over there. <laughs> we don't go over there. I don't know. It's cool. But last night, I had an awesome time, man. I got, got in there. I played a couple hours. And I wanted to get on a roulette table to start. That was my plan, but roulette tables were busy. Everything was busy. And I finally found that little short table about the size of my table. But you know what them suckers did? They ran a cable about three, two foot maybe from the wall on both sides. So when you're rolling the dice along, it jumps up and hits the thing, man. So they already thought about what crap he wanted to do, but it still worked. Um, I would say I do better on my table, but I still had some long rolls. I didn't hit an ATS, but I hit, uh, I think I hit a tall one time and maybe a small another time. And I was, I was one number off several times, but man, there was some good shooters and I stayed there. I got there. I, I see I started early and then I went back in the casino about 1030 somewhere in there. And, um, uh, stayed until seven in the morning. My girls like messaged me, where are you, baby? I'm like, oh, honey, it's hot down here. We're smoking it down here. I'm telling you. I, I think the highest I got was 2,700. I, I bought in at a thousand at the beginning. And I will say on the first session, I went down for something. And even cold tape wasn't, wasn't recovering me. It just kept breaking me even. And I, I think I waited too late to do it. And um, then you guys know, you know that feeling when you got a good strategy and it takes a good roller to win it. You know, like uh, um, you guys haven't seen my tower yet, the tower. Oh my God. And everyone loves the tower at the table. They're, they're freaking out about the tower. Okay, I'm gonna, when I get back, you're gonna see the tower and we're gonna build a big one, a big tower. A very big tower, okay, I promise you. And, um, uh, they were loving it. Even one of the dealers that went on break. Hey, I keep getting off the subject. Um, all right, I'll confess. I did drink a little bit of Captain Morgan today, but not that much, not really. Like three drinks, something like that. But maybe two beers, so no, I'm not that bad. But anyway, let's get back to this real part of it. The tower is going to be an awesome strategy for all of us, but it takes a bunch of rolls to build it up. Um, I didn't try any hedging on it, but I ended up between four o'clock in the morning to seven in the morning, just me and one other guy. And we did have our ups and downs. Okay, we did. All right, both of us. But he was doing 20, 30 rolls. I was doing 20, 30 rolls, sometimes back to back. And then it, a couple times, 0.7s. You know, you'll have that on big jobs like this. And this is a big job. But once I got up to 2,700, I uh, laid the 2,000 over, which was my double mark, to the side in the rack. And I basically said I was out of chips to the, you know, when I got down low on it. So it, oh, there's some people walking by. But anyway, um, I wasn't going below that double mark. And I could have left earlier around five in the morning when I was 20, I was 1700 up, but I was playing really good and I was really having a good time. And it was just uh, two shooters. And then one other guy came in in the early morning and he started collecting, he just let us shoot. He collected off of us, but um, it, it was a great time, man. And you know, to hold your own, that's, you know, a lot of, pe a lot of people preach, um, you know, get in the casino for 20 minutes, make your money and get out. Yeah, that's fine and dandy if you live next door to a casino, okay? 
but I don't. I don't, I cherish these times that I get to actually go play like this and I don't get this many opportunities. So when I do it, I go hardcore, hardcore. And I really feel like the North Pole and the dark side and also the cold table, when things start turning ugly on me, I'll switch to them, but then here's what happens. About every time I do that, I miss out on a damn 20 roll. And I said, I foul. Oh, you guys have to excuse me because it's been a pool day, okay? But anyway, I just wanted to say I had a great trip down here. Doubled up so far. Uh, gonna get something to eat and then I'm heading back. Uh, back in there about probably 10 o'clock tonight. I still didn't get any sleep. Um, I took a nap out here in our little, because we rented one of these gazebo things. They are very, very expensive, but I figured with my winnings, mm, so what? And Crappy, he works hard every day. You know, he can do what he wants. You know, so it wasn't that big a deal. I did smuggle my own drinks in though. So that that's an option. If you rent one of those things, you can save it on the uh, bar tab. Um, but anyway, I just wanted to touch base with you guys. Uh, Wait till you see this tower strategy. I'm very excited to bring it, bring it on. It, it, it excites the whole table. I've never seen a strategy that everyone's paying attention to and they can't really help it. When I tell the dealer, I want this thing so tall we can't even see you, okay? And one time it did get that tall, that's exaggeration. But it was close to a foot tall, okay? And we're gonna build one of them. I asked them not to clean it up. I said, don't clean it, I want it tall. And then we'll figure it out when we hit. And when we hit it, everybody's in anticipation around the table. How much is this guy gonna get paid? How much is he gonna get paid? I will say the most I got paid was 360, somewhere in there, off of one of the towers on one hit. Um, and then uh, uh, I reduced it down and built another tower back and built it to uh, 175. So, um, okay, come on. I, I can't wait to bring this to you guys. All right, Crappy's rambling on. And um, I'll tell you this, Crappy did not crap out. So don't you crap out. You get out there, you play hard, you don't give up. When it gets tough, man, and you got that anxiety, that, man, I just can't make this table work. I did that on one of my videos in the past week. But if you look at my videos this past week, I made over five grand in the video. So in this short time here, I should be able to do the same thing the same thing so hey y'all good I had to say hey to some people that went by they probably think I'm insane talking to my phone I might be I might be a little crazy but I um I kind of know some things okay well crappy didn't crap out so don't you crap out that's what I'm gonna say don't crap out